चला हे गाइस अस्सलाम वालेकुम नमस्ते एंड वनकम वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल समीरा श्री वेलकम होम लेट मी क्विकली फर्स्ट क्लोज द डोर ऑल राइट सो एज यू हैव seen the title thumbnail and everything one of the most 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 requested videos is right here my home tour now why am i saying my home tour is because this is my very own first property where i am living in as in yes uh, i did invest in a property earlier but i never lived there but this is something that i invested my parents are living i lived here i got married here my younger sister got married here Ayan spent his I mean uh, four and a half years here. Ayra was born here, Arhan was born here, Aisha was born here. So I'm super happy and glad to be sharing this home with you guys. Now let me quickly show you guys the overview of this house. Now this is a 3 BHK apartment and this is located in Hyderabad. But before showing you the hall and the dining space, first let me take you guys through my personal space. Tada! So here's the bedroom. I know you guys have already seen the bedroom tour, but things then were totally different because uh, I was pregnant then, and here everything was related to me and my pregnancy. Like you know, if you remember, there was a storage right there where I had all the snack stuff. But before getting married, I used to have all my cosmetics, my perfumes, my creams, and all kept right there. And the moment I got pregnant, I had all my snacks kept right there. And now. there is no storage that's because uh, i was thinking that the storage is of no use and i got it removed and i told earlier as well that all this no hira you can't touch the mic uh, all the furniture can be removed fixed whenever and however we want so there are a couple of changes that i did again in this particular room so i thought i'll quickly take you guys through that so as you enter first The last time I showed to that side of the space, so let me show you guys from this side of the space. So as you enter, you guys have already seen the TV unit and my most favorite, not just mine, Arhan's most favorite place. Kya hai to? What is that? This particular photo frame. So every time that I'm trying to put him to sleep, he keeps staring at our pictures. He keeps admiring me and his papa. Whee! Yes. <laughs> so he keeps admiring me and his papa and loves to watch those pictures. and this space right here so you guys know this was a sit out earlier i told in my previous video which was changed into a work desk and this work desk is right now changed into arhan's diaper station so here's where i change his diaper and uh, i'll talk more about it in detail but can you see this beautiful 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 bed hira let's just lie down and give them some nice shots Come on, come on, come on, come on! Let's enjoy this beautiful bed. Can you see how beautiful? Firstly, I love white, and the main thing that you know in the Indian families that we can't have the white bed sheets is because one, the mattress that we get in the market are usually maroon in color. I hate it. Uh, it's not just the maroon, but I'm so much in love with white because white makes our space more nice, warm, and you know more welcoming. and your bedroom needs to look welcoming in the bed should call you to come and sleep and not just the color of the mattress but also the comfort so uh, in the month of jan i have put up a story on my instagram saying you know arhan is being sleep trained he has his sleep pattern that's when i actually started working on his uh, sleep schedules now i have studied a lot you know um, how to put a baby uh, in a pattern a sleep pattern or you know how to have a proper and comfortable and nice sleep and that's when the main thing that we need to focus more on is the place that we sleep so place need to have that environment or you know that comfort that one feels to have that comfortable sleep but checking about the furniture or mattress or anything in the market or you know in the showroom you get to lie down or sit obviously in the showroom we cannot lie down on the bed and feel right i did go check touch like you know that's how we do we touch we feel we see but the only thing is i don't know how exactly or how comfortable it is when uh, arhan sleeps or when i get to sleep on the mattress and that's when i came across this particular mattress called wakefit 
now usually as i said we try and then buy right in the market but here wakefit has an option of buy and then try so you buy the mattress you have 100 days to experience the mattress if you like or if you don't like and if you don't like you can return your mattress after 100 days or you know within this 100 days if you're not liking it there are no questions asked 100% refund isn't that great and trust me guys once you try the mattress like buy and try you are never going to return it just like how i did i got this in the month of jan and i'm so much in love with it yes he also is so much in love with it we are super comfortable we are super happy try it out by yourself sleep lie down sleep jump and do whatever you want try it i will take the assurance that you are not going to return the mattress it is so 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 comfortable Arhan and I both are super comfortable with the mattress. I'm super duper happy. Now let me tell you guys about the mattress, okay? So this has next gen memory foam. Like this adapts to the shape of your body. Let it be anybody. As I said, Arhan, his body weight is very less. Me, I'm way more heavier when compared to Arhan. So it takes or it adapts to the shape of our body and makes our body super duper comfortable. And then we have the seven pressure layers on where you know it allows the air to flow and keeps to cool and also gives our body targeted support so that we can sleep comfortably. Mainly during the summers, you need to have good amount of sleep and very comfortable sleep. And the last layer that we have is the high resilience layer, and this is the foam base of the mattress which gives us adequate support. As I told, this we got in the month of uh, Jan, okay. and the mattress that we used earlier was so 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 hard and also super heavy this one person can do it all by himself so just apa and me for us to remove the old mattress was such a task you guys it was super heavy i'll quickly insert those shots right here and you will get to see it was so heavy it was not comfortable at all and uh, placing this mattress right here was so so easy so so simple and it is super duper comfortable <laughs> So I personally would highly recommend you guys to try your hands on the Wake Fit mattress it is so good the buy and try option is so great guys you get 100 days to try it all by yourself and as i said no question as if you have any issues with the mattress if you're not liking or anything you can get your 100% refund without any 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 issue that is another amazing thing so if you guys are interested in buying i'll surely leave the link in the description so please go and check it out and also don't forget to use my coupon code to get additional discount on the mattress okay so now that you've seen the mattress and the bed and all so these are like the two changes that i've done in the room to have comfortable uh, space for me and arhan one the mattress to have a very good sleep and the other one is the diaper station that we created out of a study table and uh, also you can see some of the other miscellaneous stuff right here so we have two storage boxes where i have his diaper storage so this is like his diaper candy and also you can see another uh, corner right there where we have all his uh, medicines or you know um, wet wipes and all of that we will do a dedicated separate video on that later in future but this is how the space looks and as we go that side So uh when I was pregnant you guys know that you know uh, I had some random stuff right here some books that I could read related to pregnancy and now all you get to see is these these Montessori toys for Arhan so this is what we have our bed side this side and also that side uh not just uh, uh the time that we spend on the bed but also even when he's sitting in his rocker you'll get to see all that in the later of the video but any which ways another addition that we have in the room is this our little very own uh, baby monitor the baby camera so this is another thing that i have added in the room along with a sound machine not this sound it makes the white noise sound okay so we have this sound machine right here so these are the two additional things that i have again in this room as you can see everything that i added right now you will see in white because i love white so much and uh, i love to uh, have white around me as you can see i'm wearing a white dress so yeah uh, moving forward everything basic the basic uh, regular the old thing the hanger that i had nothing much here and you'll get to see my sister who's trying to record thank you so much apa and as you come out of the bedroom ta da ta da ta da the first thing that we see is our very own dining space so a very cute tiny small uh, dining table because we knew 
that we will get married very soon and it's just mommy daddy who would be here and when ayan comes that time it was only ayan <laughs> so we thought if ayan is here so it, it would be just the three of them and that's why we thought this space would be enough but never did we know that the the family will grow so big and we will have a high chair for arhan not just arhan but uh, aiza aira whoever comes they use this high chair ayan's high chair is at ayan's home so when he comes to his nani's home he feels that you know he's the eldest son of the family so he doesn't sit on the high chair he'll be like no i am comfortable here so the high chair right now yes is yours yes it is used by arhan <laughs> Okay so as we move forward this is, this was our crockery unit so here also we had a crockery storage and again uh, too much of stuffing and always happening so i said mummy let's just remove this space and this gives like you know more spacious feel and that's why what storage we had right here is removed and as if you see the home will have too many uh, marks on the walls because as i said we got married here and too many tapes were kept when we got yeah betu yes betu that's why it's so messy that's why it's so messy yes so too many tapes were kept and uh, we have to get the uh, painting done but i thought let me just show the raw side of it and not you know the made up home and yeah so we removed the crockery unit right here and once the painting and all is done and once the makeover of the house is done i will again show you guys how we have done entire space and uh, here we have uh, four drawers right here so again these drawers have some miscellaneous stuff this drawer belongs to ayan this drawer belongs to seema aira and aiza this drawer belongs to my mom and this drawer belongs to my dad so they have all their miscellaneous stuff kept right here and again we have our very own cute little dining space and uh, the balcony is most of the times used by my dad and outside you get to see the walk area and play area and this is arhan's high chair oh my god i totally missed telling you guys something so here we have our uh, hands ka thing i don't know what exactly this is called so uh, that time when we made this it was not even i mean yeah not many people were aware of this or something like this existed and the moment uh, i got to know about it i was like we have to make something like this because life is very uncertain and we all five of us have to have that uh, bonding within us forever and also once uh, our babies you know future may when we get married and have babies when they grow up if khuda na khasta anything happens we can tell them that you know this hand belongs to samira this hand belongs to seema this hand belongs to aapa this is their nanu nani this is their nanu so they can touch and feel and know how they or their hand felt so that's why we, that that's one of the major reasons that we created this then and as you see this won't be you know as a good quality of uh, the um, the kya bolte hain this hand mold because in india and in hyderabad that is when people started exploring and uh, i i'm sure the person who made that she right now is such an expert she is she is doing so many other things but then it was like an experiment for her so this is what i got got done and because it's a memory and it's a huge memory for all of us we still have it kept like that and yeah come on so here as i was telling so here we have a room it is very much like a multi purpose room i have already made a room tour of uh, this particular room and showed you guys how we make it or you know convert it into different ways so we have a bed a murphy bed which is you can have for the murphy bed keep a be i mean make it a bedroom a small bedroom when anyone is coming over or we also have a workstation there where we can create a work from home type Hi. sort of an yes betu where we can create a work from home sort of uh, atmosphere but right now currently this has become a store room for us because as i said all of us have babies and too many uh, toys too many stuff that are to do with the babies like you know their car their cycles their scooters and everything so everything is stored right there and as we move forward right here we have our uh, wash basin the sink which is close to the dining space and uh, if you see wherever we have mirrors we have like huge mirrors because uh mirrors create an illusion of having the bigger space even if the space is very small and tiny when you place a mirror it gives it sorts of create an illusion of having a bigger space and uh, gives that reflection so that is what i wanted and that's why there's a huge mirror in my bedroom and here also 
uh, even when the designers were designing, they said, why not have a small regular size mirror? I said, no, I want a huge mirror because it's a very compact space, compact room. And when the mirror is very huge, it gives you, gives us an illusion of a bigger space and more uh, more comfortable and more spacious look. And that's why we have this huge uh, mirror right here. And as we move forward, before there, before going there, let me show you guys this side. So here we have uh, this uh, storage. And uh, this, why do we have here? Here we earlier not had nothing. And uh, now after Ayan started growing up, we started having one storage and then the other and then that's how we started building up. Here uh, we have the storage for the toys for the babies. So here we have the storage uh, which has all the toys to do with the baby and then a togra right here. And that's the kitchen. Uh, I will quickly show you guys the overview of the kitchen. So as you enter here we have a storage and nothing too fancy messed up as a regular kitchen. And this is the entry of the kitchen. We are not going inside because we are going to make a dedicated kitchen tour. That's what I wanted to do. And here we have this partition. And uh, this we removed twice, thrice when we were getting married. When Seema was getting married, we removed it. And again, when I was getting married, we removed it so that, you know, it becomes a big space and we can uh, accommodate a lot of people in the house. And again, we got it back. Okay, by the way, uh, our home is almost five years old. And uh, ever since Ayan, Ayan was uh, uh, six months old. And uh, most of those pieces right here, like, you know, like with this one, or this frame and this one, this one, all these are the things that we bought when we moved into this house and they're still there, still alive. But the other glass items are gone, like Baba, bye bye, Tata, bye bye. And uh, when I was pregnant, I did a couple of decor haul. Uh, Apa, myself and Ayan, three of us went and got some decor items and uh, vases and stuff. So that is what I placed right here. There are a couple of things that I got then and placed all of them right here so I can fill it up and uh, create an illusion of the partition from the uh, living space to the dining space and here we have a little cute rocker this is to do with Arhan and Aiza again a new member in the family or the family furniture uh, we got this because as I said we have too many kids right now and Arhan and Aiza were born together and uh, one of one of the two will always be in the house so they will get to spend and sit and uh, you will get to see his teeth right here Don't take it in the model, wash and give you. Okay. So this is uh, Arhan's very favorite space. So whenever we're sitting on the couch, his uh, rocker is turned towards the couch and he spends his time right here. And as you move forward here, we have our TV unit. And again, uh, this piece right here, this one, these are all the pieces that we got when we moved into this house and they are still alive, Alhamdulillah, <laughs> because they are kept inside, in spite of being the glass pieces, because they were kept inside, they are still alive. Arhan is sleepy because it's his nap time. Okay. And again, when you see up, you will get to see a picture, baby picture. This is Ayra. And the scan picture, this is Aiza. So Seema went for the scan last year on uh, Women's Day, I, if I'm not wrong. And she got Aiza's scan picture, but I didn't get Arhan's scan picture framed. Anyway. So th these are the pictures related to Ira and Aiza and here uh, we have a photo frame of my mom and dad. So this is gifted uh, by Anita. She uh, has been with us since the last four and a half years, ever since Ayan was uh, almost uh, not even a year old and ever since then she's been associated with us and she got this on my wedding, if I'm not wrong, correct? Yeah, she's got this on my wedding. And uh, yeah, the basic TV and here we have Xbox. So I have been a huge, huge fan of games and all. So that's why I have Xbox, but never did, never I play. I have a Kinect, which is like you can see it's dying. It's falling behind and dying. So I never get to play. Uh, but yeah, I still have it because just the fancy show off kind of thing. And as you move forward here, so we have a basic three-seater and a two-seater couch kept right here. So my laptop is right here, the candle, because I love all of these. And uh, here, if you see, here I have a photo frame of mine. And this was gifted to me by one of the Instagram pages. And yeah, and 
another thing that I want to mention, if you notice, I haven't shown any of the awards to do with me or to do with my sisters. We don't have any awards kept in the house because uh, we don't believe in physical awards. We believe in people appreciating our work, people appreciating us and loving us. So that's why most of the awards that we got, we keep them in a storage and uh, put them on the atala. I don't know what atala, sajja, whatever. I don't know what people call it. So we just leave it on the top and don't uh, like to kind of, you know, showcase or uh, put it in the frame. I did have my Vijay TV's award kept because it was fancy looking. But later I thought, no, doesn't make sense, you know, having that. I would rather put some decor pieces. And one important room I forgot to show. Can you move back, please? <laughs> Why are you standing like that? This one. This room is my mom, dad's bedroom. Now, I cannot take you guys inside the room because this is their private space and if they allow, I will make a dedicated separate video on their room and we're not going to enter into their room. So yeah, let's come. And uh, as you see, that's about this space. This is our main door. Can you please come forward? And it's the time that you guys say Tata bye bye to me and step out of my house. I'll end this video right here. See you all soon in my next video. Until I'll see you next. Lots of love. Bye. Ta-ta.